We are just connecting Facebook. So hello there. Happy, happy, happy Sunday. Welcome. This is Orbit Jewelry. My name is Kim DuPont. Hop on in here. Say hello. We are continuing on with the 12 days of Christmas. <gasps> So there are four pieces in the bling bucket tonight. If you are joining us via Facebook and you see that red live button, it means we're currently live. If you no longer see that button, you are watching the replay. You still can claim from the replay. You're gonna comment sold, a space in the number of the piece that you see above my head. All right, I am just gonna get our Facebook open send a quick text hello there happy sunday miss tammy darlene how are you ladies trash tawanda oh my gosh these earrings of fire and they're super super light how are you all um i'm just getting facebook open and i'm gonna send a quick text out Hold on. They were, ooh, what? Hold on. I have to reopen. Hello there, Tiffany, Terry, Tawanda. Thank you so much for spreading the love. I was going to say sharing and spreading the love at the same time. <gasps> All right. And it is sent out. All righty. We're ready. Hello, hello, everyone. Thank you so much for sharing me out. I truly appreciate it. Sunday night, everything you're going to see tonight is $5. We are continuing with the 12 days of Christmas, which means we're going to play the bling bucket. There are four pieces in the, in the bucket that you'll play for. Hello, thank you, thank you. Um, we have our holiday song post that I did uh, earlier. And everyone who commented, you're in that drawing as well. Tonight, we have, I did something a little bit different. So we do have some sets. I went with a gold and silver. Silver and gold. I would sing to you if I could sing, but I can't sing. <laughs> Although, as you guys were commenting today on the holiday songs, like every song I read, all of a sudden I would start singing it in my head. Did you guys do the same? Hello there. Happy Sunday. And Vicky picked one that was like super dear to my heart. I want a hippopotamus for Christmas because that was the first song that my daughter danced to uh, as a solo when she was little. It was so cute. So cute. Did you all have a good weekend? Now that song's in your head. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so welcome again. This is Orbit Jewelry. My name is Kim DuPont. We are currently live on Facebook our mobile app, as well as our website. If you're joining us via Facebook, you will only see comments that come in through Facebook. If you're on the mobile app or the website, you'll see comments coming in from all three platforms. You do wanna make sure you are a registered shopper. If you have already registered, you're good to go. Uh, registration is just a one-time deal. You can register on any one of the three platforms we're live on, you're just creating an account. If you're doing it from Facebook, all you have to do is comment the word register. Then you're gonna hop on over to Facebook Messenger. You'll receive an automated response from Orbit Jewelry. Just click on the Create and Confirm Account link. That will take you to the account setup screen. Once your account's set up, anything that you claim during a live sale is going into a shopping cart, which you have access to 24 seven. Terry had a great weekend. Hello, Donna. Miss Stella, hello, hello. Paula, thank you so much. Thank you. So we are gonna hop in here um, and I'll show some pieces and I'll kind of explain how the whole process works if you're new to us. Um, I'm gonna always, I always start with the pieces that I have on. Thank you, thank you. I so appreciate you guys sharing me out. I really do. Uh, 12 Days of Christmas Christmas continues. Four pieces in the bling bucket you guys are going to play for. Um, we're just going to keep adding to it. So even if we win, if someone wins tonight, tomorrow is day five. I'm going to put five pieces in there. Hello there, Miss Paula. Um, so to claim, if you are claiming from Facebook, you have to comment sold a space in the number just like you see it above my head. 
everyone else, all you have to do is tap on the bubble, the picture of the piece, add to cart. Easy, easy, easy. Hello, hello. <clears throat> so I am starting with the necklace that I have on. Just get my gold reindeer. <laughs> this is sold 100, 100. Um, dainty little gold chain. Here are the earrings that come with the necklace. Donna St. Martin won the Z necklace. Yes. And she picked Vivacious. My favorite Z, the oil spill from last year. It is amazing. So this one is sold 100. Dainty little necklace. You have the, like an iridescent finish to the white. Can you see that? It is a beautiful necklace. But we're doing that again. So, um... For our regular scheduled lives, we're going to pull one name for the regular live spread the love, which is what we call it sharing. Um, and everyone who shares a post or a video during the month of December will automatically be entered into the end of month Z necklace drawing. So you want to make sure you share it out publicly. That's the key because that's the only way I see the names. So when you're sharing our videos, make sure that it says public and not just to friends because I won't see it if it just says to friends. Hello there, Miss Paula, Tammy, Yvonne, Susan. Look, the sisters come in chatting neck and neck. <laughs> so that one sold 100. My earrings are... Like I was saying earlier, they are so, whoops, I was on the wrong screen. So lightweight. There we go. There we go. Hold on here. Why? <clears throat> it closed my video. Thanks, Paula. Yeah, I had to go with something holiday. I love my nail tech. I just tell her, do whatever you want. Uh, find your anchor. Like I said, very, very lightweight. They're hollow. So you they look chunky. They look heavy, but they are not at all. This is just a fun, fun earring. Sold 101. 101. Thank you. I went with the uh, whatever she suggested. I said I want something... I wanted red, Christmas red. She hooked me up and then she did the little design. Here is my bracelet. Just lining my windows up here. Cause come on. Line up, line up. Thank you. I know I was super happy with them too. Uh, side hinge. So this is the one that I am wearing. Uh, anyone who is new to Orbit Jewelry, my wrist is seven inches exactly, so that'll give you an idea of the fit. Did you, Yvonne? Did you do something holiday? Hello, Miss Patty. Retro Reflection sold 102102. You can see that detail. And because of that old design, this stays at the top. Sold 102. And the ring I am wearing, crystal corset, sold 103, 103. Oh, you should. I love, uh, if I ever tried to paint my own na nails, my left hand would look okay, <laughs> but my right hand would be a hot mess. <laughs> Crystal corset sold 103. All of the rings do have a stretch back. One size fits most. This one has that little solitaire that sits up a little bit higher. You've got your tinier white rhinestones. Sold 103 for that one. All right, so those are my pieces. Did you all have a good weekend? You're all ready to play a couple games tonight and maybe win some bling. <laughs>
And for anyone who is just joining us, if you're new to Orbit Jewelry, thank you for joining me. My name is Kim DuPont. Everything you're going to see tonight, uh, $5. We are doing the 12 days of Christmas. So we have what we call a bling bucket. And today is the fourth. So there are four pieces in the bucket that you all will play for. Trish loves getting her nails done. I want to go Christmassy. I, that is a word. It's a word to me. <laughs> yeah, just go and tell them you want something Christmassy. That's what I tell mine. <gasps> and she does. I usually let, just let her do whatever she wants to do. It's a treat, right? <laughs> we we deserve it. Um, so going back to new shoppers, thank you for joining us. So this month... Um, if you share our video out publicly, that's the key, we put you into our daily live drawing where we pull one name out um, on each scheduled live, which is Sunday, Tuesday, and Friday, and you'll receive a free um, credit for a free piece. And then everyone for the month of December who shares publicly will also go into a drawing that we're going to do at the end of the month for a Z necklace of your choice of anything that I have in stock. Anything I have in stock. So you want to make sure that you are a registered shopper first and that way anything that you claim during a live sale will automatically go to a shopping cart which you have access to 24-7 including the photos. Um, you can download our mobile app. Pinned in the comments section on Facebook are the links. It's available for Apple phones as well as Android or devices, Apple and Android. Um, it's like downloading Walgreens, Walmart, and you can access that at any point. All of our inventory is also on the mobile app as well as our website, which is orbitjewelry.com. So you can uh, shop 24-7. And I'm just watching my comments here. Used to have your nails done, Vaughn. Angela, you do them yourself? And you do both hands and the, you don't know, paint like all over your finger? Because that's the way I do it. <laughs> I just can't. I've tried. And it just, one hand looks good and the other hand is a hot mess. Hot mess. Alrighty. We are also going to do Life of the Party tonight. And as a reminder... Um, I will be ordering Fashion Fix pieces tonight. So if you have not seen those, and unfortunately I don't have all of them here, the majority of them have um, been claimed and are shipping out tomorrow, so they're all packaged up. Um, but if you go to our website or to the mobile app, there are various categories. If you're on the app, you've got to scroll at the top and look for Fashion Fix. The first 20 pieces in that Fashion Fix category are the items that I'll be ordering tonight. So if you want to claim anything, make sure you get it added to your wait list um, before 11.30 p.m. Eastern time because my the ordering opens up for me at midnight tonight. Midnight. Oh, your nails break easily. Oh, hello, Miss Terry. How are you? You know what I found? Sally Hansen. I think I think it's actually called Strong as Nails or Strong. I found that always worked. Like I'm lucky. I have very strong nails. My mother has very um, soft, and they you will break or or peel. I knock on wood. I don't have that issue, but I made Caitlin use it because she used to bite. She used to bite. Alrighty, let's hop in here. Because you guys just don't want to hear me yap all night long. <laughs> so I was starting to say, um, we're doing, I've got some sets kind of going with the silver and gold behind me. We have uh, some more green and red to get you guys ready for the holidays. And then we've got bracelet and earring um, sets. Taunting Twinkle, 104, dainty little silver. This is so cute. You've got some textured beads here, the little bit of bling. 
Did you bite? I did too when I was young, but then it just stopped and I'm lucky I've got very strong nails now. I don't have any of those dragonfly, ne dragonfly necklaces. No, I'm so sorry. I wish I did. I wish I did. That, Angela, you're right. That um, hair, skin, and nails vitamin, that definitely helps. I take that as well. That definitely helps. Take a moment to reflect. 105, hello Dawn. 105, stretchy. Take a moment to reflect. Here is a cute little silver earring. Elia, is it Elia? I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. I really wish I had that dragonfly necklace. <laughs> 106. I tried to do a trade, but that one sold out so fast. It was difficult to, um, people just didn't want to let them go. And I kind of understand. Now this earring is a crawler. Um, so at the back, you'll see it's got the post and then you have the little clip, almost like a, a clip on traditional clip on earring that will hug your earlobe, it will just click, clip on here. They're perfect for the holidays. This is a great New Year's earring as well. Um, I think I have a strand that's wrapped around the back. I do. Um, so if you just picture this one on this side, but they're really, really cute. Sold 107 Thunderstruck Sparkle. 105 um, is, hold on, this one is definitely, hmm, let's see, you know, I wouldn't say it, it I mean, it fits, it's not going to slide on me at all. My wrist is seven inches for anyone who uh, is not familiar with Orbit Jewelry, but it's not tight. It doesn't feel tight. That one's 105. Take a moment to reflect. So I would say it's fine for small wrists as well. Ah, see? That's an awesome idea. She was a biter. And now does she? I bet you she loves having her nails done. Oh, no, she works at Starbucks and can't have them at all. That stinks. That's a bummer. But if it's her, if they're her natural nails, are you allowed to wear polish? I guess I can kind of understand if you have artificial, but I wonder... If they're afraid, you know, things will chip. Now, this necklace here, I have... Let me get this pen out of my way. I have it in the shiny copper as well as the silver. And there are little hematites. I think this is kind of perfect for orbit jewelry. It should be my signature necklace. Um, moon and stars. So the silver Luna Lagoon... And this one is a dainty with the hematites. Sold 108 for silver. Not the way she likes them. 108. And then the shiny copper, which is really cute too. 109. Sold 109 for the copper. 109. I had asparagus for dinner <laughs> and I think there's a piece stuck in my tooth <laughs> and it's driving me crazy Jubilee Jingle 110 I brushed quickly but I didn't floss my bad I probably should have 
Um, this is a beautiful, daintier necklace. Jubilee Jingle, 110, sold 110. The earrings that come with the necklace and that gorgeous teal blue. A little bit of a larger earring if you prefer. <laughs> Glitzy Go Getter, 111, sold 111. Um, pork chops, we had pork chops, asparagus, and green beans. But the asparagus, I don't know, you know, sometimes it's like really great, and other times it, you get that it can be very stringy. Well, today was kind of stringy. Glitzy Go Getter, 111, 111. And the coordinating bracelet is sold 112. What did you all have? Devoted to drama. Devoted to drama. That big, gorgeous gemstone in that teal. Alrighty, this necklace I have in two colors and it'll be difficult to really tell the difference. I'm gonna hold this, cause this is the difference really between the two. The little gemstones that are on here. So it comes in blue and um, various ways. Tonight he sauteed it, um, but usually I'll do it in the oven. Why do you have a, uh, a secret recipe, Trish? <laughs> Cheeseburger and fries, scrambled eggs. Scrambled eggs. So we have it in pink or the blue. I'm gonna start with the blue. I think this is the blue one, yeah. Homemade tomato soup, yum. We were talking about soup the other, was it last week? Yeah, because it was right after Thanksgiving. Trinket Twinkle, 113, 113, mid-length necklace. You have the little, um, you've got charms you have here. I'm trying to get these to stop moving. The little hammered, different pieces, the little rhinestone on here. Whoops, it's jumping out of my fingers. And then, of course, the larger that has the blue gemstones. 113, 113. In the oven, olive oil, pepper, and salt. And maybe that's what it was. Maybe he just, you know, sometimes if you just cook it either too fast or here's the pink. Sold 114. Sold 114 for pink. Big chicken, cream potatoes, red beans, homemade cornbread. You Southerners do know how to cook. I gotta give you that. I have got to give you that. 114. And I don't think I've ever, and I used to travel a lot for business. Um, I don't think there was any place that I ever went down in the South where I didn't like the food. Yeah, probably. <laughs> Everybody does. <laughs> Wanderlust, Wondrous. Oh, this one is a last call. So there is one available in this bracelet. Baby blue, um, all of the different beads. You've got detail on the bars here. Sold 115, 115. I have a couple of different uh, blue bracelets. Here is a baby blue moonstone, 116. This one is sold 116, lobster claw closure. 116 and a side hinge. Tonight we are doing, if you missed it right at the beginning, if you hopped in after, um, everyone who commented on the post for your favorite holiday song. Sorry, I was trying to move the tag so it wasn't, but it's going to be. This is a side hinged. We're going to do a drawing for that favorite holiday song post. Everyone who commented, we have our regular share the love or spread the love. 
drawing. We're gonna do it one, we're gonna pull one person uh, for the Spread the Love. Credit will go to the winner's account and everyone who shares a video or post during the month of December publicly, you'll automatically be entered for a Z necklace at the end of the month. Poetically picturesque, 117. 117, and there's four pieces in the bling bucket. Yes, we are playing the bling bucket. Two nine, 12 days of Christmas. Gorgeous blues in there. Blue, 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 blue. One eighteen. Look at this beautiful acrylic. The red. Now this one's set in gunmetal. The color is just so stunning. This necklace is actually much prettier in person. Um, a lot of the pieces, sometimes the photos and even the camera just doesn't do it justice. That's sold one eighteen. One eighteen. Um, Now, these earrings are set in silver, but I think they totally work. And I'm just gonna kind of hold this up together. Right, let me see if I can hold that. So even though this is gunmetal, the earrings have the red, it has the um, hematite. So I think the, the gray, the silvers in the earring actually make it seem a little bit darker. Yeah, it does, Angela, doesn't it? The wildest thing I ever ate. Oh my gosh. Um, hmm. I don't know, I'm not that adventurous. Um, I shouldn't say that. I'm not a fussy eater, but there's certain things like I have never tried venison um, only just because I, my brain just says, no, don't eat deer. <laughs> um, Brad did make me eat something one time and I found out after the fact that it was rabbit. And again, if I had known what it was, I would not have eaten it. So I don't know if there's anything like really wild. I mean, I love all kinds of seafood. Oh, you had gator tail? I heard that tastes like chicken. Does it? Dress the part 120, 120 gunmetal with the red rhinestones. No Bambi, that's right, Dawn, no Bambi. <laughs> Can't do Bambi. No, one, two, zero. And my girlfriend who, her, her and her husband, they live in Colorado and they go hunting all the time and she loves it and she'll send pictures and I'm like, oh, no, uh-uh. It does taste like chicken, Terry. Tiffany, you've had deer. Do you like it? And Dawn says it does not. I think she's talking about the gator, not Bambi. <laughs> the gator. Rattlesnake, um, I heard was good. Buffalo is pretty good. Vicki, yeah. Didn't that come up before, Trish? Chitterlings chitterlings am i pronouncing it correctly they stink but they're not bad <gasps> oh dawn you didn't like it it's an acquired taste is it gamey like i i, I would, wouldn't even tell, be able to tell you although duck i'm not a fan of duck i find that very like oily you don't like venison either all right, 
I'm going to run through some quick uh, green bracelets. So we did some green necklaces the other night. Here's springtime special, 121 lobster claw closure. Sold one, two, one, one, two, one. Now seafood, I think you either love seafood or you don't. Yeah, me too, Terry. Oh yeah, Trish, no, no. Oh, I don't know if I could do that. <laughs> I don't know if I could do that. Now, ham, uh, any other part of the like bacon, although pork belly, I struggle with that. And for me, it's more the texture. Like my bacon, I it has to be crispy. Um, my niece, her husband made pork bellies like on the grill and Brad was in heaven, but I, I was just like, I can't, it's just, or anybody ever make baked beans with, um, salt pork? You put like big chunks of salt pork in. My grandmother used to make them for every holiday and people would eat like those big chunks of salt pork and there too. I think it's more the texture than anything. <laughs> My brain says no. Oh, all roads lead to Rome. One, two, two, one, two, two. So this one just slides open like a bangle and you've got your green beads on there. No, I love baked beans, homemade baked beans, but not the salt pork. Oh, Yvonne. I, I, you would like that, Trish? Um, now, Kowtong, did you all see the movie um, Monster-in-Law with Jennifer Lopez and Jane Fonda? I think that's what Jennifer made for Jane Fonda, right? It was Kowtong. <laughs> Definitely Diva, one, two, three, I sold one, two, three, silver, hematite, um, wait a minute, is that, no, that's just, mm, yes, holy moly, when the light's so bright, one, two, three, the, the green with the hematite and silver, thank you, Susan. Yeah, I had to go with my holiday. Colorful coordination, one, two, four, one, two, four. I've never eaten that. Not sure I would. <laughs> one, two, four. Frog's legs. My mother loves frog's legs. Oxtails. Nope. Nope, never had that. Dreamy Deputant. This one is set in gold. One, two, five. One, two, five. That beautiful green. So all of these are perfect with almost all of the um, holiday necklaces we've been showing. City Slicker Sleek. Three individual bangles. Here, one of which has the emerald and the rhinestones. One, two, six, one, two, six. I'm not even sure if I ever knew that oxtails was a, a thing. <laughs> Trish, you've eaten that? West Coast Wanderer, one, two, seven, one, two, seven. It has more of like an olive tone to the pearl on this bracelet. Sold one, two, seven. And one, two, eight. This too is a one and done lobster claw closure, the gorgeous emeralds. One, two, eight. All right, we got some green bracelets. <clears throat>
So for those of you that are in the South, tripe, it, that's, that's the tongue, isn't it? I don't do feet of any animal. <laughs> they step in their own. <laughs> You're too funny. Rocky Mountain Oysters. Alligator and deer. The Jamaican restaurants in Philly have that. Hmm. So for those of you in the South, grits, do you make your own? Are you guys like grit makers? <laughs> And the only reason why I asked that because, oh, it's stomach. Oh, mm, yeah, I don't think I would try that. See, and I thought I was adventurous and I thought I wasn't fussy, but all these things you guys are naming, I'm like, I don't know. Okay, so we've had, <laughs> I said tongue. Vicky says stomach. Dawn says cow brain. Terry, love grits. I don't think I've had... Um, like a true grit, <laughs> grits. And the only thing that I can really relate to it as far as, you know, um, it taking longer to cook is from the movie, My Cousin Vinny. <laughs> when they were in the restaurant and he was like, what's a grit? <laughs> All right, here we have some black and gold. So we've got a couple of different options. And I was going through some of my wraps today. And I'll be honest with you. I totally forgot that I had some of these. But oh my gosh, they are amazing. The black with the gold in them. And one has the silver. So you can really put it with either. Are they hard to make or is it easy to make? Biscuits and gravy. Yeah, that's Southern. And I would love for those of you in the South, if you're, um, you have an awesome recipe for grits, I would love to try it. This is lock stock and sparkle black cording. And the silver, these are little oval textured links that link the whole thing together. So this is definitely a shorter sitting up at that collarbone. 129 lock stock and sparkle sold 129. I would love to uh, try making them. Post earring, the matte black. Love these. Are they as good though, Dawn, as like homemade that take, don't they take like 20 minutes to make? And again, I'm going by my cousin Vinny. <laughs> Crimped Couture, 130, 130. Yum, Vicky. I thought I had another earring with that one. I guess I didn't. All right, let's do these bracelets and then I'll pull that other necklace over. Catalina Marina 131, two individual stretch bracelets. Sold 131. And then, like I said, I've got some great wrap with the black and gold. So black suede, two snaps for, whoops, sizing, 132, 132, love that. Now sizing wise, this one, if I could, so 
So on the smaller setting, it fits. I don't have a whole, I don't have any room. I have very little room on there. Rebel Radiance 132, 132, Rebel Radiance. Salt, pepper, butter, and cheese to the instant. Here's another gold. Rolling in rhinestones, 133. 133. With the hematite gold. And then you've got kind of um, the black rhinestone on either side. That one sold 133. This one has gold and white rhinestones. Fashion Fanatic 134. 134 for Fashion Fanatic. 134. And the final wrap, which has the gold and the silver chain, is sold 135. And what exactly, Darlene, what exactly is a grit? I'm assuming it's some sort of like wheat or corn or it's something, it's not uh, man-made, right? That one sold 135, 135 Fashion Fiend, 135. All right, hold on, I'm just trying to get these back on here. Okay, whoops, as I take my keyboard with me. <clears throat> and here we have another daintier um, gold and black. Corn, okay. It's corn. Fierce and Fringe 136, 136, little dainty bib style fringe necklace. Now the hardest part with these necklaces, once you get it on, you kind of have to straighten out your little fringe. Um, but then once it's all set, and when you put this away, this is definitely one of those pieces I would not just throw in a jewelry box. Hang it up or put it back into the sleeve it comes in and that way you avoid those from really getting all tangled up. Insta Inca 137 again a post with a little black fringe and acrylic almost like a the faux marble 137 And here's a cute little dainty post. 138. 138. With the little black rhinestones on there. That one sold 138. All right, we're going to do Life of the Party. Quick. So, Life of the Party pieces for anyone um, who is not familiar. Uh, each month, Paparazzi releases fashion fix items, uh, which the ordering opens up the evening of the 4th, so it happens to be tonight. I'll be placing the Fashion Fix order, the Life of the Party pieces for those consultants that have hit um, certain Life of the Party ranks. Um, we are sent one of each, depending on what rank you're at. I receive one of each that I can show. The ordering opens up the evening of the 14th, so everything that you're going to see, it's going to, on you claim it, it's going to automatically go to your wait list. Items sitting in your wait list, you are not charged for um, until I physically receive the pieces, check them into the system, and that time they move over into carts. Now, the one thing I will ask is if you have no intention on buying it, please don't claim it. 
um, I base my ordering off of the counts in wait list. So it's kind of a um, pre-commitment <laughs> to buying it, I guess, is what you're I'm trying to say. So I know they're amazing and everybody's like, oh, yes, I want it. I want it. I want it. Um, just please don't claim it unless you're sure um, that you do want it because that's how I base my ordering. Gilded Gallery 139. Look at how stunning this bracelet is. Gold stretch. So you can see I've got plenty of room. It's really fitting like a bangle. So for those of you that have little itty bitty wrists, um, this is where it's falling on me. So it's probably gonna come down further on you because that's the amount of space. That's sold 139, 139. The pieces are gorgeous. It does look like a Z bracelet. <gasps> I'm loving this. Loving this. Hey, Joe, how are you? Radiant Rhinestones, one four, <clears throat> excuse me, one four zero. This ring, that turquoise pink, sold one four zero. You can see it sits up just a little bit higher. Isn't that beautiful? It just looks like a gift. <laughs> one four zero. So I'll order these the evening of the 14th. Um, they probably will arrive because the 14th is, I'm not sure if you would have them in time. 14th is on a Wednesday. I probably won't get them until early the following week. Um, if there's anything in here or anything that you're claiming at all, not just these, but that you need to uh, make sure you receive it prior to uh, the holiday. <sighs> yeah, you want to make sure because I think items going out on the 19th probably will make it everywhere by the 23rd although mail may be a little bit delayed because of the holiday and there's so much extra so any holiday gifts that you're purchasing i would say purchase uh the week of the by the week of the 12th no because that would be monday the 19th this week or next week and if you need something to go out prior to the 19th because we ship every monday if you need something to go out prior to that, let me know. We can definitely get it out earlier for you. I'm doing awesome, thank you. <laughs> that will end up upstairs. Yes, it will. These are gonna end up upstairs as well. I'll be ordering myself a pair of these. Superstar Solo, post 4th of July, Country Music Fest. <laughs> They are spectacular. Superstar Solo sold 141. 141. Love it. Can't you picture those with a cowboy hat? I certainly can. Rock Candy Range 142. Six individual stretch bracelets. Six individual stretch bracelets sold 142. So these are all um, life of the party pieces. I'll be ordering the evening of the 14th. So chances of these making it here to me and me shipping it out um, may not get to you in time for the holiday, but um, as soon as I receive them, check them into the system. If it's something you need shipped out right away, just let me know. I know, right, Susan? So this one's Rock Candy Range 142. And, ugh, Glittering Geometrics 143. Paparazzi calls this one purple. But you can see um, you've got the smaller stones that definitely have more of the blue purple and then the larger which seem to be more blue. There's definitely a difference. Um, 
when you look at this on camera it's probably it's not I'm looking at it it's not really showing it a lot as much as it does in person 143 142 I, I the first time I tried it on it felt tight the second time I tried it on it wasn't it wasn't loose on me at all but it wasn't super tight so I think it fits um, a size uh, seven inch wrist comfortably and I don't have a lot it's not moving a lot on me now whether or not I just had it like overlapped in the card because I didn't take it out of the card when I tried it on one four three one four three one four three that's a beauty so those are the life of the party pieces I'll be ordering and again um, if you have no intention on purchasing them um, please don't claim them because <laughs> I will do my ordering based off of your claims all right let's continue on here so we have some silver and gold so this set here it's a little bit of white rhinestones in there that I pulled the bracelet and earrings to pair with There we go so that layered look highlight of my life 144 sold 144 tiny little white rhinestones layered look is very popular Standalone Sparkle 145 sold 145. Texture on the ring. So there's no bling on the bottom part of this earring. You just have that one stone. That one sold 145. Very lightweight. Here is a clip on. Blissed out sold 146. Blissed out. Four, six. Bangle forged uproar one four seven. One four seven. And a side. This is solid. You can hear it. Across the constellations. Here too, you've got the random little white rhinestones that one sold 148 148 gold now this necklace has the matching bracelet and it has a little block and there's a bit of iridescence to this the little block earrings to match block party princess block party a princess sold 149 149 that one is 149 the coordinating bracelet which has a lobster claw closure so this will fit all size wrists 150 life of the block party sold 150 that's cute too we will be all decked out for the holidays bubble bursting bling hey Kara, no worries girl 151 151 love these earrings very very lightweight it's a little bit more uh substantial size hoop that one sold 151 and looks great with this all right let's do the bling bucket so there are four pieces in the bling bucket the way we play this everybody is going to comment one playing card you're going to comment one playing card 
only. What do I do with my deck of cards? <laughs> Comment one playing card. It's a full deck because Miss Paula did win on Friday night. Um, there were four pieces in the bling bucket. I'm calling this the 12 days of Christmas. So if we have a winner, um, all you're responsible for is the shipping. If you have an order going out next Monday, um, cause this, today starts our new shopping week. If you have an order going out next Monday, we just put your winner, um, your winnings in the outgoing package. If you don't, that's fine. We'll invoice you for the shipping of $5. So while you're commenting and you're only going to comment one time, one time only, um, the play, a playing card, and then I'm going to pull a card. The first person that matches the, the, the card, <laughs> the first person that matches the card will win. If we have multiple people um, who have the same card, I'll split the pot between the two. Um, so that's the way we're gonna do it. We're gonna split it if, and if it's an odd day, I'll just add one in there to split it. Um, but I was gonna talk about the shipping. So first time shoppers, when you're shopping, use coupon code FIRST, and that is spelled out. So F-I-R-S-T, um, you'll get free shipping on your first order using that coupon code. After that, our flat rate for the week is $5. So our shopping week runs Sunday to Saturday. Carts expire every Saturday at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You must be checked out prior to that time. Um, anything sitting in your cart come five o'clock is going to automatically drop out. If the items are on wait list, they move over to the next person waiting in line. Um, <coughs> excuse me. And all orders ship out on Mondays. Orders ship out on Mondays. So we got four. And there's one of each. There's a necklace. There's a bracelet. There's an earring. And there's a ring in the bucket. So I'm going back to our comments. <clears throat> 12 days of Christmas. So tomorrow I will add a piece or if somebody wins tonight, I'll put five pieces in the bucket. Our next live is on Tuesday. So Tuesday is the 6th. There will be six pieces in the bucket Tuesday night when we play. So we're going to play this on every scheduled live. Um, normally we do this game on Friday nights, but for 12 days of Christmas, we're going to do it on every live. <clears throat> All right. Let me see what we have so far going up. Susan Foucher, seven of hearts, Darlene, 10 of hearts, Terry Rothenbacher, eight of spades, Angela, 10 of hearts, Tracy, three of hearts, Terry, King of Spades, Vicky, Three of Hearts, Don Tucker, Three of Diamonds, Patty McMillan, Queen of Hearts, Susan Durso, Eight of Hearts, Caramilla, Ten of Hearts, Joe Calder, Six of Diamonds, Margaret, Eight of Clubs, Tanya, Two of Hearts, Cara, Ten of Hearts, Debbie Saracino, King of Diamonds, Doris, hello there, welcome, 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 my name is Kim DuPont, I'm so glad you're here, Tiffany, Ace of Diamonds, Kara, hello. <laughs> Sorry. So for anyone who is just joining, we are playing the bling bucket game. There is never a purchase required at all to play any of our games or be involved in any of our drawings. So all you have to do to be entered and play along is to comment one playing card. You're going to comment one playing card. And then I'm going to pull a card out of the deck if you match or if we have the same people, the same number multiple times, I'll just split the pot equally out to everyone. So go ahead, comment if you're just joining us and I'll give it another minute while we wait. I'm going to grab another piece and show you a couple more pieces. Whoops, now this one, I did a couple of different bracelets. 
with this one. This is a really cool necklace. It's so different. So here it is. Again, to me, it looks like just melted metal or, you know, if like if you're decorating with chocolate, you just do those swirls. Soulmates. 152 sold 152. I think this is stunning. It's lightweight. The earrings are a nice size. That one is sold 152. 152. Now the earrings I think with the necklace are perfect, right? They're not too small, not too big. Here is a little hoop, very lightweight. Keeps adding a comment there, I had to move my mouse. Dune Dynasty 153 sold 153 for Dune Dynasty. I'm gonna do these two bracelets and we're gonna pull a card. Now this has a bluish silver tone to it. It has the buckle style kind of slide buckle style closure. So this will fit all size wrists because you can really pull this to make it smaller. Jungle Cat Couture 154, 154. Black, and like I said, it has that bluish tint, like a blue gray, blue gray. And here we have a deeper gray and this gorgeous medallion. So this will slide um, based off of the setting, right? There's two snaps, two snaps on that one for sizing. And the gray leather, that charcoal gray Treasure Quest 155 sold 155 for Treasure Quest. It is beautiful. 155. All right. I'll put that up there. Okay, here we go. Full deck of cards. We are going to. Give it a shuffle. And obviously, you have to be here. <laughs> he commented. All right. Let's pull a card out. And it is a three of clubs. Three of clubs. So we have ace. King, 10, 2, 8, 6, 10, 8, Queen, 3 of Diamonds, 3 of Hearts, 3 of Hearts, 10, 8, 10, 7. So we do not have a winner. We do not have a winner. So this card will not go back in. So make a note of it. This card will not go back in. And... Actually, that one's gonna go in the box. I'm gonna leave the cards out. That one's going in the box. The cards are gonna be in here. We're gonna play again on Tuesday. But Tuesday, there will be six pieces in the bucket. Six pieces in the bucket. Alrighty. Let me hop over here. So <clears throat> what we're doing now, I've got bracelets and earrings. So I paired some pieces up so we'll kind of go through these pretty quickly boldly be dazzled one five six stretch in the orange that one sold 156 157 157 fish hook backing Sold 157. This is a little orange, the deeper orange stone at the bottom. Lightweight earring though. Very lightweight. Magnetic closure. 
Suburban Outing 158 sold 158. The orange. Love these earrings. Post extremely lightweight. 159 circulate the room. It has a like a rattan. 159. Here's a cute little urban with the orange embroidery. This too has two snaps leather, two snaps for sizing. 160, 160, 158. I think it's this one, right? Let me just double check. I think it's that one. Yeah, suburban outing. So it is the perfect fit on me. I've got a little bit of room in here. But that's exactly how it fits on me. Seven inches. One, this one is 158. I also have this one in black with gold. I had to think. It's black with gold bars. 158. Um, so this one, 160, the little embroidery, 160. I have these earrings. I have to tell you, you're so welcome. I love these. Now, this is definitely a statement earring, extremely lightweight. I've worn it with orange. So this is more of a burnt orange. You've got your natural or the cream color. Um, rust, it would look great with rust. Silver, black. Twine Tango. I've got these on the way. The whole earring is this color. So it's all that natural. That one's 161. 161. The black? Yeah, I can grab the black one. The black bracelet? Yeah, I can grab it right now. <clears throat> so here is that one in the black and gold. So seam exact, the magnetic closure, black and gold. Suburban outing 162. This is leather. 162. Actually, I'll just put it right in there. But I also grabbed this one, which is black and silver. For those of you who prefer silver, this is a, basically the same bracelet. But instead of the bars, you have the little silver um, beads on them. 163, 163. Magnetic closure on that one. And this one is probably the same fit. This one's actually a little bit larger than the other one. So this one will just kind of come down if I push it. That's as far as it's going on me. So I've got a little bit more room in this one than I do the other one. Cruise control. Cruise control. 163. Here's a twine pull cord. Very beachy. You're so welcome. High tides, 164. 164. Right? Cute with these. Did cute with the earrings that are coming in. The whole earring is that color. That one sold 164. Um, I have another that is similar, but this one has chocolate brown and the silver block beads. Oh, yeah, the hoops, Susan. The hoop, golden green. Beachology, 165. 165. And here's another cute little pull cord closure. This one has wooden beads. The road not taken, 166. Sold 166 for that one. I think that's the one you're making. Yes, yep, I can grab them. They're actually right behind. 
the wall behind me. <laughs> I have idea. They are right here. And I can actually put these, I'll put them on a bust with the necklace. Um, I love these earrings. Hoop. So I think it will pull, because this almost, I'm looking at myself in on Facebook, this almost looks like you can see green in there. There it is. I think, <laughs> excuse me, I think it's beautiful, <laughs> actually. Especially if you're gonna pull, you know, put green with it. And, and if you haven't seen this ring, this ring is perfect with these earrings. Um, my gosh gold leaf glam 168 yeah so everybody what do you think let Susan know so this has the flex of green and little dome shaped yeah see and we have our expert uh, stylist Terry who's great at putting pieces together <gasps> I think it would just all pull together because it's definitely picking up the green. Isn't the necklace beautiful? It really is. And it's very lightweight. And I think no matter what you put it with, it will draw that color out. That's the beauty of the iridescent. You really can kind of pair it with other pieces of a particular color, right? Because it'll pull that color out. Yeah. You girls rock. This is sold 100. 100. I can scan it and that way you can just have to click on the photo. So there it is. That one is sold 100. And you can see, I'm going to just kind of hold one of these. Right? It sits up. It has the faceting all around so it's definitely picking up the colors and the light yeah that one is sold 100 100 I love it love it you're so welcome here is another magnetic closure bracelet there we go with a yellow iridescent sold 169 that one sold 169 yellow so for the yellow I've put a couple of different yellow earrings powerhouse call 170 170 for powerhouse call lightweight I will let you know if any of the earrings are a little bit heavier Meadow Musical 171 sold 171. This one has the little yellow rhinestone. 171. And this one has a little acrylic bead. Festively Floral 172. 172. Festively Floral. 172. So any of those with the yellow will look great. Still glowing strong. Stretchy. 173. 173. And then the earrings. 
Now this one has a little bit more weight, um, but, and it's a post back. So with the posts, and for those of you that have been with me for a while, you know the, the deal. Um, they'll come with a metal backing. If you prefer a rubber backing when you're checking out, you have the ability to add a note. Just to add a note, please send me rubber backings. I'm happy to include them in your order. Ultra Universal 174. Perfect. Together. 174 for the earrings. But I could wear those earrings all day. I don't think they would bother me at all. Here is Don't Forget Your Toga. <laughs> don't forget your toga. We put a blue rhinestone earring with it. Sold 175. 175. Here is the earring. Lightweight 176 Revolving Radiance. Sold 176. Navy blue rhinestone. That would also look good with, if any of you got the, um, won the lottery necklace. Oh, speaking of which, Paula, are you still here? She was going to the casino last night. I want to know if she had any luck. To be dazzled or not to be dazzled. Navy blue, little gemstones, lightweight, a little bit on the daintier uh, side, I think. Kind of medium length. That one is sold 177. Here is a blue and orange boardwalk boho 178. Oh, sold 178. 179. This one is 179. I've got a couple of different bracelets that would pair with those earrings. Mojave Mandalas 180 Lobster Claw Closure 180. 180. And whoops, nope, I already I already showed that one to you. Uh, this is, I think, the last one I have. It is. So a little coil with the blue. Sold 181. 181. 181 for blue. 181. Here's another wrap with hematite. Two snaps for sizing on this one. Now taking the stage, 182, sold 182. Now taking the stage. Spinning with Sass. <laughs> what a fun name, Spinning with Sass. 183, 183, hematites. 184 Sparkle Stream is the name of this piece. Sold 184. 184. And this one really sparkles. Fan of Glam. Fan of Glam Post Back with this earring. Sold 185. 185. Look at that thing. Sparkle. Lightweight. Very lightweight. Oh, my copper gals. My copper gals. Here is a dainty little wrap. Two snaps on this one. And to give you an idea, it is the perfect fit on the smaller size. I don't have a ton of room in there, but I do have a little bit of room. Worth the hype. 186, 186, the little copper tone. And they're little block beads. 
sold 186. 186. Cosmic Chandeliers, 187. Topaz. Cosmic Chandeliers. Here's another cute little dainty. Bollywood Ballroom, 188. Sold 188. I have not sold them out now. I have not sold out. But I did buy quite a few of those. Industrial Eden, 189. Now this is a clip-on earring. It is beautiful. A clip-on sold 189 Industrial Eden. And here we have a double wrap. Or actually this is a triple wrap. Because this one's mighty long. So the center, this is called Catwalk It Off. They call it brown. The brown definitely has more of a copper feel because it has a, um, a sheen to it, like a um, metallic, a little bit of a metallic finish, right? So this is a triple wrap bracelet. And... You just put that because the center of it has the larger topaz. Did I miss the blingy wrap? I'll grab it. You didn't because I didn't show it, but I'll grab it. <laughs> Can't walk it off. One nine zero. One nine zero. I think you may have seen it, but I will be happy to. There it is. Put on your beast face. So this is a gray, the two snaps for sizing. This is beautiful. The tag just fell off on me. Um, hematite. And then the center of this, so like little itty bitty um, beads in there. It looks great with silver. It looks great with hematite. It looks great with gunmetal. That one is sold 191, 191, and it does sparkle. It really does. <gasps> it's so pretty and so lightweight. So, so lightweight. I was working on um, wraps. For those of you that know, I've kind of been redoing my uh, jewelry room a little bit. And I was working on wraps today. And, oh my gosh, Angela, it's gorgeous. Um, here is a deep red leather. Two snaps. You've got white rhinestones. And I do have this one in white. Did you see that, Angela? Did you see the wraps that I showed earlier today? Um, the black with some gold. This is Ultra Urban 192. 192, I know. And I have it in white as well. So if you'd like to see the white, let me know. I will grab it. So a couple of earrings I put... 193 Garden State Glow. 193. Hello, Susan. Thank you. Honestly, I have no idea. I have had this for years. Years and years. <laughs> I pull it out this time of year. Oh, poor Angela. You poor thing. I hope my voice is not <laughs> making it worse. A more to love heart hoop, heart hoop. Valentine's Day. That one is sold one nine four. 
and here's a medium to larger hoop depending on what you know consider medium this one is sold 195 195 shiny down the center it has like a almost like a rope like texture uh, right around the on the edge 195 monochromatic magnetism people let these go this weekend wake up and sparkle 196 so i have four available people let them go out of their carts oil spill stretchy wake up and sparkle that one is sold 196 it is so pretty itty bitty a little oil speed oil speed oil spill beads and paired with these before and after glow 197 197 perfect 197 for those here is a post brass now this one I've got two different bracelets one hinge look how cute that is and then this chunkier style um, whoops let me turn it around because that's where you're gonna see that charm right and the charms so the earring is Daisy Dilemma 198 that one is 198 how cute is that whoops side hit what <laughs> do that all the time side hinge sold 199 oh, I love this bracelet this bracelet I do have this one in silver um, and this one actually has like a little almost like a little snap um, if you have a little itty bitty wrist it's probably gonna come down a little bit more but it is you can see the size 199 oh I can try I thought I had one um, I think someone let one of one of those go this weekend um, hold on let me what did I do with that one it is right here it goes no nope. so this is the last one it's sitting in a cart right now um, I can try and get more of this I can't promise though but that one would be sold 200 the oil spill this is actually set in silver majority of the time we see pieces set oil spill in um, gunmetal this one is in silver and I can try and get more of those but I can't promise that I will be able to now this bracelet does have the lobster claw closure and I think it's on the card backwards 201 complete charmony complete charmony how cute brass chunkier chain sold 201 201 whoops stay <laughs> <gasps> fame night 202 lobster claw closure it has a bit of a sheen to it it's like a champagne light champagne color right it looks great with ivory 202 called fame night lobster claw closure now i'll be honest i love these bracelets but if my husband's not here i cannot close this put this on by myself 
the, the um, lobster hook and this is difficult to do by yourself. I think until this, you wear it enough where the leather will soften up a little bit, but when they're new, keeping it <laughs> on there. I have not tried this with the paper clip trick, but the paper clip trick, oh, and I had one down here. I had one down here. You take a paper clip, I'm going to make sure that it's here for our next live. Um, and you put it through, you run the chain through the paper clip and it makes it long enough where you can kind of hold on to the paper clip and then use the lobster claw to close your bracelet. Um, these are just make it a little bit more difficult at the beginning because they're flat when you get them. Or bracelet buddy per Susan Foucher. <laughs> you need the bracelet buddy. <laughs> so this one is Fame Night 202. Here is one that is more of a blush color, right? Also the leather band with the rhinestones. Hustlin' Heart 203. 203. I have to... Uh, I have to write that down because you've told me that before. Bracelet buddy. <laughs> Everybody jot that down. Bracelet buddy. Buddy. 203. Sold 203. This one is perfect. It looks like a bow. Yeah, Susan, so the two Susans got one. Lights Selfie Action 204. 204. I wish I had more of these. Um, this on, if you have a fitted sleeve, this over that sleeve on both arms would be beautiful, right? I'm just gonna hold it. But to cover like the edge of that sleeve, it would look like it's part of the top. And with any one of those little blingy bracelets, here is a oval hoop with the rhinestones at the top and then smooth silver. Much better than a husband. <laughs> That's funny. That is funny. Sold at 205. 205. Mr. Boing has his moments too. As I'm sure I do to him. Yes, that does make good sense, Joe. Yeah, to clip on the bottom part of your um, scarf together, that'd be cute. Oval ruled 206. Very, very light. That one's 206. 206. All right. We are doing the holiday song post. There are four pieces in this little packet. And we had a lot of. I'm going to actually take out. I need to get another bucket. Take out my bling bucket pieces here for a minute and put my post tag. So we did a what's your favorite holiday song post earlier today, first thing this morning actually, and everyone who commented on that post, your name is in here. So, and you are playing for a four-piece mystery pack. So again, no purchases required. Uh, you're just responsible for the shipping. All right, so I'm shuffling up, shuffling up, <laughs> mixing up <laughs> my little tags. And I have one, and it is Miss Terry West. Mr. Bling wrote these out for me. Terry West in his little itty bitty writing. <laughs> So congratulations, Miss Terry. Are you still here? Terry, Terry.
Harry. I hope she's here. Yay, she's here. So congratulations. You are getting a four-piece mystery pack. So congrats. Now, unfortunately, all the packages are going out that are going out tomorrow are closed up. <laughs> so we'll send this one to you next week. Um, so congratulations. We're going to do more of these types of fun things. Fun things. And I'm so glad because there were comments that if you didn't go back, oh, you're so welcome. If you didn't go back and look at the comments, um, go back and check them out because there's some songs, I don't know, they're either you know, songs that you might know, but maybe a different artist, or there are songs on there I've never heard of. So if you want to expand your holiday uh, song <laughs> playlist, I'm looking forward to um, checking those out. Checking those out. Now here's another magnetic closure, black cording, and this one, um, has the oil spill set in gunmetal. Keep your distance, 207, 207. Keep your distance. Keep your distance. Little daintier pull cord oil spill. All right, let me spread these out. So this one has the black leather and then the two strands that have the little oil spill beads. 208, 208. I'm anxious to go back and listen to some of those songs. Extra envious. Extra envious. You'll be the envy of the party with these babies. Whew. Love. And here we have Galactic Go-Getter 210, 210, uh, those Z necklaces they go with, put it with green, yellow, blue, pink, like there's no need to even put a necklace when you're wearing an earring like this. I mean, you can, but that earring is just so beautiful that that just is center stage. Gilded Gardens 211, 211. And this one is a perfect match to those. That one's set in gunmetal as well. That one is 211. I'm running out of space here again. All right, let me put my empty those out. Put my Sahara Serenity 212 paired with this new cute bracelet. Sahara 12 brass. Sahara 12. Sahara Serenity 212. Hello there, Miss Diane. 212. And this turquoise stretch bracelet with a little heart. It's called Stony Hearted and it says created with a purpose. Created with a purpose. 213. I also have these cute little sea bead bracelets. So this one is on a pull string closure. Bead bold, bead bold 214. Sold 214. And with that bracelet, I paired. Come on. This earring. Gorgeously grounding 215. 
That one is sold 215. 215. Badlands Botany in red with a little sunflower. Stretchy 216. 216. I also have it in the turquoise color. 217. So these are little seed beads connected by the charm. So 217 for turquoise, 216 for the red. Post back, 218 Farmstead Meadow. Post earring, Farmstead Meadow. Wildflower Walkway sold 219. This is a lightweight earring. I think the look of it makes it look heavy, but it is not at all. That one is 219. Look cute with either one of those. And here we have a silver pearl. And these are all strung on here individually. Things are looking upscale. Things are looking upscale. Sold 220. 220. And these seed bead stretchy bracelets, which has that metallic um, silver. So it actually matches extremely well. This one is 221, sold 221. And these are all connected. Um, and then you have the clear bars on there. 221. 221. Make sure I hold it up. So it's not upside down. Believe and let go. Two, 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 a lobster claw closure on this one. That one is sold. Two, 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 believe and let go. Brass in the brown. It actually feels, I think it's, it feels like leather, but I don't think it is a leather an actual leather. Although it might be. No, it's not. Not an actual leather band. That one's 222. And here we have Sunrise Stunner sold 223. 223. Um, you can see it has a bit of a wave to that earring. That one is two, two, three. And this one a little bit more statement. Terra Topography sold 224. 224. And grass, 224. 225. Pink, so pink, we went with a statement, pink or a daintier, but both have that gorgeous, vibrant pink. I love these. So this one, 225, the longer of the two earrings, all for the glam. Now this is not a heavy earring. It is not a heavy earring. Isn't that gorgeous? That one sold two to six. And this one here, which has that solitaire in the center, sold two to seven. Two to seven. Two to seven. That bright pink. 
bright pink. Here's another stone stretch, which has the multicolors. Orange, yellow, turquoise, white. You've got the two charms, one uh, just a little silver bead, and then the heart. Love you to pieces. Love you to pieces. Sold 228. So this one, you really can do anything, right? You can put any one of those colors, put it just with silver. Here is Mesa Mustang Pink 229, 229. I have this earring with the white stone as well as the yellow stone. Yellow stone. So yellow is sold 230, Flower and Frontiers 230 for yellow. The white, which is really more cream color, right? Paparazzi calls it white, but it's definitely more um, cream. Two, three, one. Flowering Frontiers, two, three, one. Two, three, one. Or we have a white stone hoop. So again, ivory or cream. And a nice comfortable weight. This is not a heavy earring. That one's 232. Sold 232. 232. And I'm gonna do this white suede. This has a magnetic closure as well. Clustered constellations, white suede with a little silver beads on it two three three now this one i actually have um a couple of different little white seed bead um bracelets as well but i put this earring so that bracelet's 233 the earring this has a um very faint iridescent bead to it so it's a clear they almost look like snowballs, don't they? I think this is great for the winter. I mean, a lot of times we think of seed beads as, you know, more of a summer um, piece. This, I think, is perfect for winter. That one's two, three, four. Two, three, four. Here is Bead Bold in white. So we saw this one earlier in turquoise. Here it is in white with the gold um, pull cord closure. Sold two, three, five. This one would be cute with those earrings because this has the clear little beads on there as well. Two, three, six. Two, three, six. For that little pull cord. And of course I had to. Look, we're doing the white seed beads. Here is a gorgeous statement earring weightless, right? You can't even feel these on. But I'm gonna hold them like this so you can see how much movement. Actually, let me hold one of them out of the way so they're not bumping into each other. So you'll see how much movement this earring has. Colorfully circulating. 237, 237. Here's a couple cute um, stocking stuffers for teenagers another seed bead purple yellow and turquoise camp flower power 238 a purple and silver all beaded up 239 that one is 239 and this little guy funny how they put a tag on one but then put the other one on a, a card so this is the same bracelet just yellow 240 base camp boyfriend 240 and the black is 241 so you have the two strands that are the primary color and then one strand that has I'm just trying to get the second strand out of the way. One strand that has the multicolors. 
two, four, one for black. Loudly layered in yellow, little lemon yellow. Um, these are little rubber discs in the shape of a flower, along with the silver. Again, extremely lightweight. You probably can't feel that one on. 242, and this one is 243. Festively Flower Child, 243, yellow and white seed bead. 243. All right, I'm going to do my spread the love spread the love so like I said anyone oh, I'm shaking it and there's nothing in it <laughs> I'm like wait a minute here that's better um, anyone who shared my last video which was Friday night that was the last time we were live uh, no we were live did we go live Saturday no we didn't so Friday night <laughs> losing my mind um, any post from that point, that live, if you shared it or any post up until going live tonight, as long as it was shared publicly, you're in here. We are pulling one name and everyone who shares during the month of December will automatically be entered into the drawing at the end of the month for a Z necklace of your choice. So tonight um, and every live show, We'll pull one name. It's always based off of a prior live or prior post. So this is the one drawing that you do not need to be present to win. And our spread the love winner tonight. Again, I need to put it in the big bucket because my nails are hitting the bottom of the bucket and I can feel it. It's like on a chalkboard. <laughs> there we go. Oh, that's so much better. And I have more room. All right, let's pull one out, and our Spread the Love winner tonight is Miss Dawn Tucker. So congratulations, Dawn. I will add a credit to your account for Spread the Love. So thank you so much to everyone who shares our videos out. Um, it truly does make a difference. Um, our followers are growing and it's because of all of you. So thank you so much. Um, I truly do appreciate it. I'm trying to grow my business. So congratulations, Dawn. All right, I'm going to do one more a set. One more a set. We'll do this. Actually, yeah, I'm going to do. Oh, I lied. I'm going to do two more sets. I lied. And then I'm going to make sure I have all my counts for Fashion Fix. So if you have not seen the Fashion Fix items, um, go to the website, orbitjewelry.com, or to the mobile app. Go to the category Fashion Fix. The first 20 items in there are the Fashion Fix items I will be ordering tonight. If um, you click on the photo, you will also be able to see uh, an option for featured live. So you'll get to see the stock photos as well as the times that I showed it on a live show. You're so welcome. Nautical Nouveau 244, 244 Y shape. Look at how beautiful this is. With an ivory top, it's gorgeous. That one sold 244, that Y shape, extremely flattering. Nautical Nouveau. The matching bracelet, lobster claw closure, 245, sold 245. And this great hoop which is sold 246. 246, again, very lightweight on the daintier side. That one is sold 246. I think pearls, most people, you either love them or you hate them. <laughs> Now this one is set in gold as well. This was is called Soon to be Misses. 
soon to be misses. Sold two four seven. That one is two four seven. I have a clip on earring. So you have the pearl earrings that come with the necklace, or you could put a little clip on and the clips themselves are daintier. 248, that one is 248. And the bracelet that I put with this, also a little bit of a chunkier chain with that one, Lobster Claw Closure, sold 249. 249 for Nautical Mileage. Nautical Mileage is the name of that one. All right, my friends, so we're back Tuesday night. Tuesday night, 8 p.m. Eastern, 12 Days of Christmas continues. Uh, there will be uh, six pieces in the bling bucket you guys will hit play for Tuesday night. Um, I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your Sunday. Check out Fashion Fix. Um, if there's anything that you want, add it to your wait list. I'll be doing the ordering tonight at midnight. At midnight, my time. So, again, thank you so much. You guys have a great evening. Have a wonderful Monday. It's Motivational Monday tomorrow. Keep your eye on Facebook. Love you guys. Thank you so much. Good night. Good night.